Dean! What's up, man? Wanna play a game of skate? Sure, babe! Okay, someone please explain to me what the hell that was. Well, that was an inward heel flip, which is basically a pop, shove it, and a heel flip. Alright, so first off, it's a really hard trick. Don't be disappointed if it takes you a while to learn. So you want to have your feet, you want to have your back foot really nice, solid in the middle. A big problem, the big mistake that a lot of people make is they scoop too hard, which means that they'll scoop and they won't get the inward down, uh, get the inward in there. So you just have it nice in the middle and get a nice juicy pop. Um, with your front foot, you want to have it about halfway, a little bit above, and have your foot tilted in towards your back. You don't want to have your foot straight or tilted forward because when you have it straight, you might get the nice heel, um, like a nice heel flip, but you won't get to shove it in. And when you have your foot tilted forward, you're only gonna get the heel flip. There's no possible way you can get to shove it in there as well. So when you inward heel flip, you wanna make sure that you get the nice pop. And then with your front foot, instead of pulling forward or pulling outward, you wanna give it somewhat of a vertical kick. You wanna kick down after you pop. So you pop and then you kick down so that your board does that motion. And a good way to practice that is by just standing there and then kicking your foot out, uh, just doing the bail or whatever it's called, just so you can get used to the motion of popping your board uh, downwards and vertical. So, a lot of common mistakes, uh, one that I see a lot is people don't even know what they're doing. Like they'll just stand on a board like that and then just in skate just kick it out, whatever. So, you want to have, you want to make sure that you don't tilt your front foot forward because when you tilt it forward, you can't get to shove it in because your foot is too tilted, focusing only on the heel flip. Um, another thing you want to look for, for your back foot, you don't want it in the pocket because this part, this trick, you kick down vertically, which gives the whole board the motion. When you have your uh, foot in the pocket here, and scoop, uh, you're gonna scoop more and not have any time to kick down and then like wrap your foot around and land it. So you really want to make sure that you have your foot positioning somewhat close to this. Have your front foot maybe tilted a little bit more down or a little bit more up, whatever works for you, but just don't have it too far out. Or if your back foot too far up in the pocket. Um, so let's go over what you guys learned today in your heel flip. Make sure you have your foot positioning like this. I can't stress it enough. Don't try to scoop this bitch. You can't scoop and then possibly heel flip like ninja wrap your fucking leg around there. It doesn't work like that. You need to have your feet like this. Uh, it's not a pull forward, it's not a pull horizontally, I guess. It's a vertical kick down. Like you wanna, you don't wanna pull out, but you wanna kick it down. I hope you guys learned something. Um, you know, leave a comment. I love reading comments. If you have any questions that you, like any tricks that you need help with, uh, you know, leave a comment. I'll be glad to do simple stuff like all these shove it, heel flips, kick flips, or even like harder tricks like hard flip trick tips. Um, I'm a heel flip person though, so. You know, preferred heel flip, doesn't really matter. Leave a like, likes always help. We're also doing this thing that for every like I get, I get a dollar from my mom. Right, mom? Yeah. Yeah. So I get a dollar from my mom for every like for new shoes because I am in need of new shoes. So please leave a like, it helps me a lot. Um, subscribe if you haven't yet. We post weekly videos. So I'll see you guys next time. See, here are my shoes. I really need new skate shoes. These ones are from Adidas. They're pretty ripped through right here. That's not that bad, but they designed it really stupidly so you can like finger this shit and the tongue's all loose and slips over like that whenever you skate. And then this pair is my Janoski's shoelaces is like third pair or so. Like right under the duct tape here, it's just one big ass hole. <laughs> it's pretty, pretty fucked up. And then there's like holes on the top right here. So, you know, leave a like, please, I need shoes.